Hello, welcome to another Hidden Gem Movie Recaps. Today we're gonna talk about a movie about a paramilitary organization betraying the president a 2019 movie called Angel Has Fallen. So sit back press the CC subtitles and enjoy. Secret Service agent Mike Banning undergoes training at a military facility in Virginia owned by Wade Jennings, his former Army Ranger commanding officer. Jennings is now the CEO of Salient Global, a private military company. President Alan Trumbull recommends Banning for the position of Secret Service Director to replace retiring Director David Gentry, and Jennings asks if Mike to consider him as training contractor to get rid of his debt. However, Banning keeps his migraines, insomnia, and chronic back pain, resulting from previous combat injuries, a secret and relies on painkillers to cope. During Trumbull's private fishing trip at Queens Lake in Williamsburg, a swarm of armed drones attacks, killing his protection detail. Banning manages to save Trumbull, but both of them are incapacitated. While Banning recovers, Trumbull falls into a coma. FBI agent Helen Thompson receives falsified evidence pointing towards Banning's involvement in the attack. They found a strand of Mike's hair in a van that launched the drones, leading to his arrest. On the way to a detention facility, Banning's transport is ambushed. He escapes after eliminating the attackers. He sees a familiar face from the Virginia training site, revealing them as mercenaries from Salient Global, with whom he had undergone a training exercise. Realizing that Jennings betrayed and framed him, Banning contacts his wife Leah from a nearby gas station assuring her of his survival and determination to expose the true culprit, and also talks briefly to the FBI because Mike is aware they are phone tapping. However, Thompson traces the call, because a bounty hunter recognizes Mike at gunpoint, forcing Banning to steal an 18-wheeler truck from a militia man while being pursued by numerous police officers. Banning crashes the truck and escapes. At the White House, Vice President Martin Kirby, now acting president, accuses Banning of the assassination attempt, claiming support from the Russian government. Mike eventually reaches his estranged father, Clay, who has been living off-grid in a cabin in the backwoods of Whitehall, West Virginia. After resting, Banning and his father spot salient mercenaries approaching their house. Clay detonates multiple explosives around the perimeter, eliminating the attackers as they escape. Banning flashed the coordinates of Clay's hut to a toll camera then they split up. Discovering the bodies of Jennings' gunmen outside Clay's cabin, Thompson realizes that Banning was indeed being set up. Trumbull awakens from his coma and Kirby is exposed as Jennings' secret co-conspirator, seeking revenge for Trumbull's supposed assassination against Russia. Clay went to Banning's house to save Leah and Lynn from Wade's mercenaries. Thompson and another agent, Ramirez, confront Jennings on an airfield, but Jennings kills them both. Banning infiltrates the hospital using his operational knowledge as Secret Service, surrenders himself to Gentry at the hospital. Trumbull orders his release when he realizes that salient mercenaries are targeting him, and only Banning can keep him safe. Banning realizes the hospital oxygen is getting hacked to detonate. With the help of Gentry and other loyal agents, Banning guides Trumbull to safety. Meanwhile, Jennings' mercenaries increase the oxygen and nitrogen supply in the hospital's ICU to dangerous levels causing an explosion that destroys the hospital. Banning hides Trumbull and Gentry, while Jennings' men pursue them. In the ensuing gun battle, most of Trumbull's security detail is killed, but Banning thwarts a flanking attempt, buying enough time for U.S. federal law enforcement officers to arrive. The mercenaries retreat, and Jennings and his remaining men gather on the rooftop, planning to escape in a helicopter. However, Banning destroys the helicopter with a grenade launcher, though Jennings survives the explosion. Banning engages Jennings in a knife fight, ultimately inflicting a fatal wound. Banning is clear of all charges, and Trumbull and Gentry arrest Kirby for treason and corruption, as detailed records of his involvement were discovered by Thompson. Clay decides to live with Banning and his family. Overwhelmed with guilt for failing to protect Trumbull and concealing his ailments, Banning offers his resignation. However, Trumbull forgives him and offers Banning a promotion, which Banning proudly accepts. If you like more of my videos please consider liking and subscribing to my channel so you don't miss out on more movie hidden gem recaps. Thank you.